What's going on? What's going on, man? Got another one. This uh, 61 Suburban swap. Call it the Yellow Bus. <sighs> this radiator came from a uh, 68 Ford aftermarket one. Uh, gonna put it up here on the front. Put a plate right there. Screw it right into the same hose we got here. So you don't see it. Just about that big on each side. So it just had a radiator. We'll take the clutch fan off of there. Gonna do a fan on here. Also, let you fan. Uh, shit, I'm using the Honda one. Uh, basically, uh, yeah, just trying to throw something together real quick. I know which headers to fit in there, but uh, as of now, we were just gonna put these stock ones back in there. Motor look a mess. We could have cleaned it off first, but for some reason, they just wanna hear it start now, too. So I'm gonna go ahead and crank it in a little bit. I don't think it's gonna happen today. I'm kinda in the middle of which direction I'm gonna go with this project, man. It's like I had a harness already set for it and was gonna do drive-by cable. But then when I look at it, he's missing a lot of stuff in the inside. So I find myself thinking, just go ahead and do drive-by wire. Completely updated, make it new school. Um, when you think about it, look at the brake lines we got right here. We got the regular lines from the, the truck. So, man, there's no need in trying to make it stand alone. It damn near should have stayed the same way it came. But, uh, yeah, let me show you what it looked like right now. Let me keep you guys updated on it. Sixty-one with the LS in it, five point three. The basic setup. <clears throat> And it's got the 4060, we hope we don't shred that. But if it ran it in the Suburban, I don't know why it shouldn't run in this. Minus the airbags, minus all the other features. But look at the insides, man. Doing some big things, man. We can do better with the doors and the walls of this thing, but man, it's like an open, open canvas when you had these old cars, man. Look at the front seat, center column and all. And uh, when you look at it, this is the reason why I'm saying just going with a new pedal. I have this pedal. Think about it, we got this brake pedal. I'm trying to figure a way to modify this so we can still keep that one. You can just go ahead and put the new Silverado one in. New Tahoe one. I got I already got a parts car over there too. I'm about to yank the motor up out of that one. Same thing with this gas pedal. Go in there and source these parts and we can just put a pedal right here, right here and then end that. So it's all on what you're trying to do, man. Classic old school gauges. Think we should keep that, just spray paint it, make it look nice. Just the look. Definitely need three seats though. Third row would have killed them. We still got space though. But anyway, man, back at y'all with that one, man. This, this is basic little something. Stay tuned, stay tuned. You know, give me a few days, man. I got quite a few things going on, so I can't just focus the next few hours on just this. I've still got to go pull this Tahoe motor, man, because I need it. But, um, yeah, anyway, man, that's it right there. Stay up, stay tuned, man, and start wrenching, bruh. Keep doing some real stuff with your own projects, man.